Hello world. In this uh, video I want to go over how to add a featured post or a featured image to your post. So I'm working on this website. You may be watching this video on this website or you could be on YouTube. Doesn't really matter but I want to add some images to my post. Um, so when you go into an actual post, let's just say this post title and there's this little featured image section. When I set an image Let's just say, let's pick this one, set the image, and update. When I reload the front end, I want that image to show up you know, in my post, and maybe even when I click on the post, onto the single page as well. So to do that, we need to you know, edit the markup to add the featured image. So in my uh, theme files, in my case, I'm using the index.php, which is the default blog layout. And you can see here, I have this uh, the WordPress loop. It just checks to see if it has the post. If it has the post, and then it just loops through this over and over again, and it gets get template part. So template part slash content dash card. So that's probably the area that I would need to edit. So template parts, content cards. So here we have the actual markup that's displaying each individual post. So you can see, you know, you got the card, you have the image right here that's not currently working because it just says dot, dot, dot. And then you have the title and yada, 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 the content. So what I want to do right here where it has the image, I want to display, um, you know, that featured image that we just uploaded. So WordPress has some cool nonsense of course to add le to show the post thumbnail. So to to show it real quick we could just do the underscore post underscore thumbnail. Just adding that code right there should do it. So if we save that and we reload the front end you can see that that post has that image in there. So that's cool. If I I can't click on it though, and if I go into the actual post, I don't see that image anywhere. So let's make this bad boy clickable. So what we could do is wrap this code here, you know, in an, an A tag. Um, put it in there, and we want to to go to the actual single post so you can see down here when you click on the title it's doing this get permalink so that's exactly what we want to do as well so we could do the same thing in here do some PHP tags and do the permalink something like that so we save that and reload again and then now you can click on it and it goes to your single post. So if you're not familiar with WordPress, the permalink is when you're inside of a loop, considering we're just talking about a single post right now, this single post, the permalink is always the post that you're talking about. So this is gonna go to the single page. It's, it's a pretty cool little trick. And I recommend using it. You never wanna hard code anything. So use the permalink. Uh, there's a lot of documentation you know in the WordPress docs that goes over the permalink but you this is pretty much the only thing you're going to use when you're building links out into uh, post alright so now that we have it clickable um, let's go ahead and add it to the single page so down in my theme files here we got single and you can see here that it's doing the the loop again and then it's just getting the content so that would be this area right here so I want to add that image in here as well. So we could do again some PHP tags. The post thumbnail like that there. So now when we click on this, it shows right there. So that's not clickable and everything's all well. You may want to, you know, put your title above it. So that would be be moving this, you know, down here somewhere under the header. 
above the content maybe. So you can play with it, move it wherever you want to. You just need to make sure, you know, that you're not putting it in any HTML code. If you are, you need to, you know, close some PHP tags and open them back up so that your markup is correct. So the last thing I want to talk about is back over on my content cards. Uh, this permalink. This post thumbnail, I want to add a class to it because I'm using uh, Bootstrap cards. And you'll notice that for the images, they have this card-img-top that will add some styling to this card. And uh, if you inspect your, your image here, inspect this, you'll see that it has some classes on here, but there's no, I didn't add any classes to it. So I need a way to add a class to it. And it's pretty easy to do inside this post thumbnail. You can tell it what image size you want. For this case, I'm just gonna use the full size. So when I go responsive and I make these smaller, you know, it'll get, it'll jump up to that big size, you know, whenever I get to that size. Um, so full size, and then here we can add an array. And inside this array, we do class. And this is where you tell it what class you want. So I need to use that top IMG, is that what it was called? Uh, card IMG top. Save that, refresh. Looks like I got a coding error here. So I didn't put a comma here refresh and there we have it now you can see if you inspect that element again you'll see that it has that card img top on there so that's pretty much uh, adding a featured image to your wordpress theme if you have any questions please feel free to add them in the comments below